Hello boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, pipe lovers, pipe smokers. This video will not be about coronavirus, so don't worry about that. So, I'm smoking, sorry, my lemon or citrus wood pipe with some German ebonite and some, I think it's cocobolo, not sure. And in there, I have again the swan because it's a tin of 100 grams you need to you know smoke that thing so what I will talk about today well I have a couple of things I got few packages that I received one of them is from a good friend of mine from Germany She sent me a couple of tins of Raiko in between, which I will store, maybe use one or two, yeah. And I will store the rest. I got some material from Germany. And uh, I have been talking to Mimo because some of you probably know uh, that uh, recently I'm ordering material from Mimo like a year now or maybe even two I'm not sure anymore anyway um, and some of you know that Romeo Domenico or Mimo is located very very close to Milan on north part of Italy where is where they have a lot of that thing that we will not talk about today so I was asking him what's going on with with his material because I have an order that I need to get from him so yeah we will see he needs to check his stash to see how much material of that first class that I'm ordering usually he has so that will be something to wait on and in the meantime I have ordered a couple of rods of acrylic so uh, they arrived yesterday and that's a green acrylic I'm working usually these days and also I wanted to get a chocolate color of acrylic but uh, my supplier in Germany didn't have it so he suggested me to get oh geez packaging he suggested me to get uh, another green to get something that is more like Cumberland reddish like so I said okay not a problem I don't have a problem with that material it's it's nice material okay Ooh, what's that oh great another paper perfect anyway um, what I still need to order and soon that is why I'm waiting Mimo to come back to me and let me know his material storage what he has right now what I am waiting right now is uh, Mimo to come back to me with the informations I need those are tenants that I'm using great stuff from Delrin and um, 
I'm waiting uh, because I need to order still some ebonite and also I would like to get some Chris Kelly's rods uh, it's a great material I have been working with it for some time now and I love it at least some of the colors it seems to me that some of the colors polish a little bit better and some a little bit mm, not that great or not that easy as those that I love for example this bluish kind of color it polishes really great and black ones seems to be kind of a, a trick to do you know but either way it's a great material really light really easy to shape and 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 everything aside from polishing you need to you know work a little bit to get it really well polished but that's okay I don't mind uh, so yeah um, I got some uh, tobacco from USA and um, I had some trouble over there because guys from that big company that I'm ordering from recently are sending their packages as a super saver option and that super saver options comes to different exchange offices in Europe and sometimes you catch office that is not in Europe like Switzerland and uh, it's no fun you know you gotta pay taxes for that so um, I asked them uh, about if this will be a normal case or just isolated case and they told me you know we cannot uh, we are shipping like that and we cannot um, no, we don't know where uh, the the bulk, the, the big package will arrive, where they will distribute to separate customers. So it's okay, you know, it's how it is, how it functions. That's why it's cheaper, so yeah. Anyway, uh, I ordered some Robert Lewis 3 mixture. Seems to be very nice tobacco. I have to see but I first need to smoke that swan from AGU tobacco because you know the tin is big and I'm not smoking that much uh, here in the workshop like a pipe per day in the workshop sort of so it will last for some time anyway what what was really funny with that Robert Lewis was the fact that it says on the tin Robert Lewis St. James Street I think London 1780 something I bought it in USA and it says also manufacturing in Germany so I was like what the hell <laughs> oh well <laughs> anyway I changed my pipes that I have in my uh, pouch for everyday smoking and I brought this one out it is made from a, a last piece of lemon I had uh, I got from Mr. Grandolfo as in pieces in blocks a long time ago and uh, I made couple of pipes using that lemon wood so I saved this block because it was super tiny as you can see the bowl is really really small but it's okay for me you know quick smoke perfect so uh, what I've been doing today let me show you I was shaping two pipes one that is looking like this should be a nice one has Chris Kelly black stem has vintage material from Stanwell company that I got from Joao Reese and the block is I think from Mano from Italy I'm not sure well we will see how that will turn out 
And um, this one, I'm really happy how she turned out. I love the shape. She will turn into a super nice pipe, I think. Not too small, but it is small. So that is why I like it so much. Chris Kelly stem, vintage Stanwell and uh, Briar is first quality, first class quality and you can already see the grain from Mimo. God bless Mimo. So, I uploaded yesterday a video for Morda and um, I hope you look at it because it's really nice video covering that topic and also please go on the website from Davorin Jenovic he has some information over there and the link that I put in the description of that video will le lead you to his site where he talks about what Morda is but what's interesting on that page when you scroll down you will find a nice picture of uh, how Morda is aging so when you click on that picture it will be a bigger one so you can you know download it or whatever I'm using it as a reference here not that it's much of a reference but you know it's kind of nice so check it out anyway that's about it what I have for today haven't been thinking about anything particular to talk about just random stuff to keep you guys updated I have finished two mortars and uh, one of them is sold one is reserved so we will see what will happen with those and um, I think I will not have uh, Monster and Sundays tomorrow um, because uh, I don't have any finished pipes other than those two that I already showed in one uh, video and in that video for Morta yeah so yeah enjoy the weekend guys I will smoke my pipe put these in my case and um, I will probably go home to be with my family enough working for today I think but I need to finish this one have fun guys okay bye bye be happy